Hi, I am Dr. Suresh H.S., Consultant Neurosurgeon, practicing at Premier Neuro Center, which is located at Isro Levert, Bangalore. Sir. In children, memory is very important for learning process. There are many factors which are responsible for the memory disturbances in children. They are lack of proper diet, that is a lack of a balanced diet, vitamin B deficiency, thyroid hormonal deficiency, lack of adequate sleep, mental stress and mental disorders, certain drugs like uh, anti-epileptic drugs and anti-psychiatric drugs, lack of physical and mental exercises. So, to avoid this memory problem, we have to take care of all these things. So, child needs proper balanced diet and we have to make sure that child should get the adequate vitamin B uh, in the diet on the daily basis. If there is a thyroid hormonal deficiency, which is commonly called as cretinism, in this case, the memory disturbances will be there. We have to identify this problem appropriately at appropriate time and we have to replace the hormones to avoid this problem. And a child should get the proper sleep because memory consolidation happens during sleep only. Lack of sleep will lead to uh, the memory disturbances. In case of uh, stress, if there is excessive mental stress, and physical stress and if there is a mental disorder the hormones which are secreted will damage this the neurons and neuronal system affect the memory so that's how the mental disorders and mental stress will affect the memory now come to the medicines which affect the memory some children uh, will uh, take the medications like you know anti-epileptic medications and anti-psychiatric drugs these drugs will slow down the activity of the neurons. That's how it affects the learning and the memory. So, unless it is uh, properly indicated, we should not uh, uh, treat this patient with these medications. And we have to choose the medications appropriately. Now, the physical exercises and mental exercises. If there is a physical good exercise that keeps the body in a, in a fit state and also it helps the brain and the circulation to the brain and daily learning daily solving the problem and these things will exercise the brain we have to accept the challenge we have to learn the new things these things will lead to the increase capacity of the brain to learn and that improve the memory in children so by doing all these mental exercises we can keep our brain in a fit state and we can learn and we can keep our memory in a good order.